here's a quick guide to help you set up your solar water feature. Once everything has been taken out of the box, the first thing you need to do is position the base where you would like to have the feature. Place the reservoir bowl onto the base, make sure to line up the guide markings, and then twist to hold in place. Now, place the sprinkler bowl inside the reservoir, making sure to line up the guide markings like we have here. Next is the solar powered pump. Flip over the solar panel and push the tube onto the middle nozzle, then plug in the pump to the solar panel, making sure it is watertight and then you can finally attach the tube to the pump. Now, place the solar panel on top of the sprinkler bowl so the pump is hanging into the space below. The last thing you need to do is attach the fountain head to the top. Then add some water. Make sure to fill it up enough so that the pump will be in the water fully submerged. Finally, turn on the solar panel. To do this, you twist the switch under the fountain head. In order for the solar panel to receive a full charge, the switch underneath the panel must be placed in the off position, then switched on to activate the pump and the water flow. Now comes the toughest decision, picking your fountain head. There's four to choose from. Since the feature is solar powered, you're free to move it around your garden without having to rebuild it. Just make sure to choose a sunny spot for your feature so that it can receive as much charge as possible.